Joe Snowmobiles here. Uh, I'm going to be doing the wiring. Actually, I'm not doing the wiring on this car. I've already done it. But I have to do it on my other ML. So what I thought I would do is show you how to remove this to get to the wiring behind the panel and wire up your own lights for your Mercedes ML, 320, 430, etc., etc. And uh, so we'll take a look behind here, see how I did it before. And this way you guys will know how to do it on your car so let's get started so first you want to do is pop out these little tabs here and you got to take a, 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 a flat head and just pop them out and there's a bunch of them along here because you have to get this piece out from underneath so I'm just gonna quickly pop these out just work your way down you may not be able to see me over here doing it, but I'm doing the same thing on this side. Just a skinny flat head will do it. Okay, so I popped all those out. I've got to run and get a uh, Phillips head um, screw gun. All right, I got my screw gun. I'm gonna take out these Phillips head screws. One, two, three, four, five, and last one over here is number six. All right, then you should be able to just lift this piece out, if I remember correctly. Just kind of pop it out from behind the lock. And then you should be able to, oh, I didn't show you this already, but this piece unscrews out of here, Phillips head again. And then, let's see, this should pull back. I don't, I don't think I popped this off though. I think you gotta take off this. My handy pair of socks. Oh, okay, there's a Phillips head there. Take that one out. Um, let's see. I think I might have had some trouble getting it past that little piece before. I don't remember, and I don't remember if I took it out or not. I don't think I did. I think it can squeeze it past. You gotta pry it up and over. Okay. So. Let's see, I don't remember if I popped this panel off or not. You know, there is some sort of plug back here, and, and, and Mercedes must have had a OEM plug kit that you could install which I didn't have so I, I actually snipped the wires off the back so let me go ahead and pull that through I need to cut a couple zip ties and I can show you okay my side snippers just gonna cut a couple of these zip ties that I put in here to hold everything together Anyways, let's get back to this. So I've got that off. Uh, probably have to take off another screw here. Yeah, another Phillips. Under here. Okay. Another one over there. Let's see here. Okay. There we go. Another one of those. Gotta take that off. Then, should be able to pry this back far enough to get in here, which I can now. I'm gonna stick my screwdriver in there and I'll bring the camera around. 
All right, so here's what we're up against. I mean, you could continue to take off screws and things to get to the wiring, but I think this is good enough. I'm gonna bring the camera around so you can see what's going on inside here. Okay, so what we got is, we've got the Curtis hitch. I'll zoom in also. I'll zoom in a little bit here. So just to go over that again, Brown from Curtis to blue from car, black from Curtis to red from car, yellow from Curtis to green from car, brown from Curtis to blue from car, and red, uh, I'm sorry, uh, green from Curtis to pink from car and then white from Curtis to ground What I've done is there's a plug here, okay, which would have been originally for the lighting kit and There's also another little plug there. I'm not really sure what that but basically. Yeah, just yank that sucker out and snip those wires off close to the plug if you want to use the plug plug later on or something, whatever, you may want to snip it farther back. I couldn't find one that was an OEM. Maybe Mercedes carries it. I didn't even call. My guess is it's pretty expensive. But anyways, that's how you do it. I hope that helps you. And then just run your, your wires out through the side here. And there you have it, four flat. All right, guys. So thanks for watching this video about how to install the trailer lighting in your Mercedes ML320. And uh, just check my other videos. I've got all kinds of videos on how to fix various things with these ML320s. I just did a, another video on how to repair your, or uh, put, install a hitch on an ML320. You can check that below in the description. And again, thanks for watching. Happy 2017. And don't forget to subscribe and check on that notification if you want to see more videos from Joe Snowmobiles. Thanks and have a great new year.